DE guideline 4 is content and activities. Subguideline 4.1 states provide a variety of activities and resources that facilitate communication, collaboration, learning, and engagement. Subguideline 4.1 further states that students will benefit more from activities than from simple presentations of content. Learners interacting with you and interacting with their peers and interacting with their content is critical to engaging them in the class and having a successful semester. Interaction is an important part of the learning process, and we found that the community of inquiry model does a good job of illustrating the three main types of interaction that exist in a course. They are learner to instructor interaction, learner to content interaction, and learner to learner interaction. So students interact with the instructor, students interact with the content, and students interact with each other. But as far as planning for this interaction, one model that you can follow is called the Absorb, Do, and Connect model by William Horton. Take a moment to reflect on your class and see if there's a balance of different types of learning activities. For example, you want some absorb, some do, and some connect. So what is an absorb activity? Absorb activities are activities where the learner is absorbing information either through reading an external article or watching a video or listening to a lecture. So they're taking in through various ways the information. You want to also have some do type of activities where the students apply what they're learning in formative or summative activities, maybe through interactive websites, through class discussions, or small group work. And then you also want to have connect type activities where they take what they've learned and they apply it to real world situations with authentic assessments and meaningful things that they can do to demonstrate their level of understanding always aligned with course of learning objectives. 4.1 also points out that students need to know that what they are learning is relevant to the overall course. Students need to know why they are learning it, and they also need to hear why they are learning it, reinforced from multiple perspectives, both from the perspective of their instructor through absorb type activities, and from the perspective of their peers through do type activities, discussions, and small group work. Lastly, consider using Laulima lessons to lay out and present your course content and activities using concise and clear language describing how the content and activities align with learning objectives. Learning activities should be authentic and not disposable.